on the last episode of A Prepper's Life. So I'm going to have to go out and wait to haul in computer stuff. Okay, she's here. 100 bucks today, huh? Protected us from that mean old black cat. I'll help. She says, wow, wow. Now, on this episode. <laughs> Last time I did this in reverse, uh, wasn't that long ago. Oh well, here we go. Well, I thought I was doing pretty good on that. I got hit with water from the faucet deal. Cause you got the hot and cold coming up and it connects in into one. So that one, when I took it apart, it sprayed me. Oh well, we got more to do. I forgot, I think there's uh, something up underneath there that Holds that on, so I need to take that apart. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna put a um, sandwich baggie over the ends of these uh, water lines so that we don't get sawdust and okay. sanding dust and paint and everything else in them. Okie dokie. There. Wasn't that smart thinking? Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. Got that side ready so that Mrs. Subtech can start doing her sanding uh, when it's when the putty's dry. Now it's time to pull out the stove so we can do that side. This is fun. <clears throat> right. Safety first, look for the range. Oh, dryer, hot water, range right there. That would be number nine, which would be right here, seven, seven, nine, eleven. Let's hope that was it. Turn that off so that we don't hurt ourselves when we start unplugging things. Okay, well that's odd. You would think this would be off. And it's not, so let's double check what we did out there. Okay, all right, I see what I did wrong already. I turned off number nine, which was kitchen ground fault. I meant to turn off number six. So range, range, so six and eight. There we go. You got a six and a nine sideways. Sometimes you get confused. <laughs> okay. It is off. No lights. No lights. We are safe to pull the range. All right, so I've got uh, some of the fire breaks in. I wanted to take a break from that and uh, move on to the frame. But you can see 
the door frame, but you can see the fire brakes right there that I put in. And uh, of course, over there as well. Now I'm gonna work in this little doorway right here and put us a nice uh, sturdy piece across the top there.